Got the baby semi out today. Welcome back everybody. David Shepard here on the Humble Hotshot channel. Obviously not hot shotting today, but I would say humble semi trucking with the single screw, single drive axle, little day cab international 8600. So I'm gonna show you guys uh, the truck we're driving for a buddy here, what we're hauling with it, and uh, give you the ins and outs also on the land all trailer here behind it right after a quick word of scripture as always. So today I want to share Psalm 19 verse 14 which says let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be pleasing and acceptable in your sight O Lord my rock and my redeemer. So just real quick want to encourage you guys to really just think about what is the meditation of your heart? What do you speak and also what do you spend your time thinking about? Um, whether it be relationships, material things, business, whatever it might be, try to focus those thoughts towards God is what this uh, passage is telling us to do. So thanks for listening, guys. Now I will show you uh, what we've got going on. Like I said, we're driving the International 8600. This one's a 10-speed with the M11 Cummins. So a 10.8 inline six Cummins. We love that. 10-speed manual, super fun to drive. I'll actually give you a little glimpse inside. Got to run in because it is, sorry, but it is cold out here. It is like, I don't know, maybe 14, 15 degrees, but there's that like freezing rain drizzle. I don't know. It's, it's, uh, it's somehow raining, but it's freezing up when it reaches ground temperature here and it's icing up the deck and everything else. So got the heat going in here and, uh, just give you guys a quick look at this small dirty truck, but there you go. It does have uh, heated mirrors, which is great three-position engine brake which is great and a locking diff and of course that 10-speed Eaton Fuller with your range selector there's your shift pattern actually in case you guys were interested but anyway now I'm going to show you the Landall trailer behind us which we're going to be using to load and haul this Fuso Mitsubishi Fuso actually plow truck four-wheel drive we've got that chain down um, I think this is going to be final position. We picked that truck up this morning and put it on the front half of the Landall. I'm trying to get some good. I'm trying to get some good weight on that drive axle because of the slick roads um, without overloading it too much. So, got the Fuso on there about where I want it, and then we we're going to be loading this 12 valve Cummins that's running over here. So, but he also picked up this dually 12 valve five-speed unit. So you can see her choochin' on the lope tune over here. Quick look inside. Oh wow, everything's frozen. If you guys can see that, that is, that's not Rhino Liner, that's, that's just ice. So, probably not gonna film a whole lot because of that. There's gonna be probably a little bit more content with this 12 valve actually. You can see, typical 12 valve leaker. It does have a pretty massive oil leak we gotta fix. And uh, some tuning and such as well. But, we got the Fuso on there, and we got a spot for the 12 valve there. And I guess I'll just give you guys a quick look at the functions on this Landall trailer. Basically three hydraulic functions. Your fifth wheel to raise and lower, basically your tilt, your winch. You can see there's a big loop of a chain drive winch in there. And then your axle. This is actually a slide axle. So the entire tra trailer axle slides on that cylinder ram in there, and that's your third function on the hydraulics. So I still have to hook up the PTO hoses. Uh, I've got multiple trucks running, so I'm not really gonna film a whole lot more, but I did wanna show you guys uh, the little uh, kind of other side of the trucking industry, running the semi truck, even though it's just a little baby semi and a single axle land all, but it's actually a really cool equipment trailer. I'll, actually, I'll do another video showing you guys how the tilt and everything works. Um, maybe when it's not so bitter cold and icy out and I'm slipping everywhere. But thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoy the content. I know it's just kind of a big mash of different things. But, hey, we got three pretty cool trucks here today. So why not share them with you? And um, hope you guys enjoy while you're nice and cozy inside the house watching this video or something. But I'm going to keep working, keep myself moving get these trucks chained down and uh, get back over the hill before the roads get too bad. This is uh, its crazy. Actually, the gravel is even icing up. Anything this drizzle hits, it's just a sheet of ice. So trust in God as always, and I will see you guys next time. Take care.